everyone, this is Lanchester Fine's latest video on selling secrets. This is an auction lot that I purchased for $25. You can see in the green box it says I won. Now these items in that picture I wasn't particularly interested in. They are vintage, but it's not really Christmas or the normal things I buy. But my selling secret today is to make sure you look at all the photos. So in the description and even in the title it says holiday and it says holiday decorations, figurines, hair barrettes, tray table, and that's not in this photo. So I thought I should click through and see more. So I went through and I clicked on next to see the next photo and it wasn't very descriptive. It was just a bunch of boxes. There was a little Build-A-Bear there, but then I flipped to the next photo and it showed more of the detail, those novelty classes, but also two pewter figurines. Those look like they're from the 80s or 90s and those were good items to sell more clothing and then those two cross pens I will absolutely sell and that um, trinket box of wood and then this probably will all go in the garbage but this had a neat 1980s plastic novelty charm necklace and those awesome vintage barrettes now I typically would not sell those but when I looked those up I was super happy with what they're worth these I will just pass on to Goodwill. So we really haven't gotten to anything fabulous yet. There's some books, um, some floral things, this cool hand-painted TV tray that folds up. But what I really wanted, and you'll see it in this next picture, were these awesome figurines. Those tumbling Santas with the cowboy boots are super rare and I saw in another picture of another lot at the same auction the third Santa so I bought this lot and that other lot for those three Santas now they're showing some detailed pictures of more items most of these are going to go right to Goodwill but I basically wanted those Santas and if I could sell some of the other things that'd be great here's some country curtains these looked very, well, they definitely needed to be ironed and I just did not want to deal with these. So those went right to Goodwill. So because I looked at all the pictures, I knew exactly what I was buying. And I really wanted those three Santos because they are pretty rare and are probably worth over $100. But in the meantime, I sold the glasses for $10. These vintage barrettes must be quite rare. I got a message from someone willing to pay up to $60 for these. So that will be a good lot. I have a ton of watchers on that, and I think I started the auction at 30. The vintage 80s charm necklace will probably go for 15, and this great uh, salt and pepper shaker that's just the Mrs. Claus shaker is a $9 item. These pewter items were actually worth some money. They're signed, and um, this one actually has the original jewelry in it. So those will be good items, and this beautiful hand carved trinket box actually had the artist's card with it so I knew exactly who made it and what it was. So this is the other lot from that same auction. Again, you cannot tell from the pictures what's in there. I did only pay ten dollars for this. Um, it was a lot of stuff so keep in mind also that when you buy all this stuff it is work to sort through it, take the stuff that you don't want to Goodwill. I don't usually ship snow globes so that'll go to Goodwill. Um, so it is a lot of work, but sometimes it's worth it. There were some really cool folk art, wooden, hand-painted wooden Santas here. So I will sell those, and those will easily make, I don't know, 10 to $15 a piece. This one I have to look at a little closer to see if it's original. I loved this old world Christmas style Santa with the burlap bag and then those skinny pencil Santas there ended up being three of those in all of those bags only this one is really shown that Yankee candle pillar candles brand new in box I did list that so there's the other skinny pencil Santa and there's our cowboy Santa 
So the last picture, and then there's two glass Old World Christmas Yorkshire Terrier ornaments. I will be selling those, and the other ornaments I put in a lot. So the first lot was 25 and the second lot was 10 For $35, I got a lot of really nice items to sell, but most importantly, I got to reunite these three Santas. And I'm very excited about these. They are from Japan, and I believe they are Norcrest, and that should be the best item in the lot. But there's plenty of other things that I will sell and make a nice profit. So it pays off to look at all the photos. Check out our Facebook page for more information on Lanchester Finds. And as always, you can shop us on eBay. I'll put the link in the description below. Thank you so much for watching, and please consider subscribing.